today I'm going to be doing the how much does your face cost tag and basically what this tag is is you show your everyday makeup products and you add up how much each item costs and you get the grand total. Um, I just want to put a little something out there. I live in Canada so things might be a little bit more expensive and uh, yeah. So the first item I have to show is the Benefit Pore Professional Primer, and this thing. Is yep. <laughs> this thing is amazing. Um, I actually stole this from my mom because she didn't like it, so she gave it to me. She was just like, "Here, take it." I was like, "Okay." First of all, this thing is thirty-six bucks, so it's it's not something I would go out and buy myself. This claims to be oil-free, lightweight, translucent, and silky. And this minimizes your pores like no other. This thing is like... My baby. The next thing I have to show is something that you guys have seen in the past, like, three videos. I've mentioned it since I bought it, and I've been using it for about a month now. And it is the CoverGirl Outlast 3-in-1 Stay Fabulous long-ass name foundation. This thing cost, I think, 11 something. I think it was like a random number, like 11.97 or something like that. Like This is my favorite foundation. I'm wearing it today. <sighs> it's so silky and it, like I tried comparing this to the Revlon Mousse, which is what I was using before, and it just doesn't even compare. Like the other one feels so thick on your face and this one is so lightweight and it has a pump, which is like unheard of. Yeah, there's a hair. So the next thing I have to show you guys is something that I've also raved about, and it is the Garnier 3-in-1, um, nope, Skin Renew Anti-Dark Circle Roller. This thing's kind of pricey, it's it's still drugstore, which isn't like breaking the bank or anything, but it's 16 bucks, but I mean, this thing lasts forever, oh my god, I've had this for s what am I doing? I've had this for so long, and it's just lasts forever, and I use it under my eyes because I have the worst dark circles in... The world. The next thing I have to show you guys is a concealer, and it is the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer, and this I got also from the drugstore. It was, I believe, like around seven dollars. I got this a long time ago, and it is the... I give up. I give up. I just give up. It's a repurchase, that's all you gotta know, and I love it. The next thing I have to show you guys is also something I've stolen from my mom. And it is completely destroyed. It is the Benefit Coralista blush, and I <laughs> might have used it a little bit. I mean, just a little bit, right? Um, and this thing is being high end. It's thirty six dollars, um, which is kind of pricey, but I mean, this lasts me forever, and it is amazing. It's just the perfect like coral flush on your cheeks. It has a bit of shimmer, but I mean, it's not really like chunky glitter, and it's not. It's not really that noticeable. It gives you like a glowy look, but it's not like, hey disco ball, how you doing? You know what I mean? The powder I've been using recently is the Rimmel Stay Matte Powder, and I bought this I think a month ago. I've been using the Maybelline, is it Maybelline? The other famous powder. And I, I didn't like that one so much. I mean, I thought I loved it, but I, I just, I guess I wanted to try this one. And this thing is amazing. Like, it lasts all day and it makes me, it keeps me matte, which I love. And yeah, I get really oily and this just keeps me matte. Well, you would hope so. I mean, stay matte. This is uh, around like $5, I think I got at the drugstore. To do my eyebrows, I, um... I use a very, <laughs> I use an eyeliner that is essentially almost black, which doesn't really make sense, right? But I don't know, my eyebrows are naturally really dark. Um, and I use the Annabelle Cole Eyeliner in dark gray. And this, this is just run its course. It's, it's needs to be sharpened. This, I, I'm pretty sure you can get at any drugstore, um, at least in Canada, and this, I believe, costs also around $5, um, relatively inexpensive. So, for my eyes, I like to keep it super simple, and I only use about, like, two or three products, depending on the day, depending if I'm lazy, if I wake up late, 
yada yada. So the first thing I like to use is the Maybelline Color Tattoo, um, and it's in Barely Branded, and it looks like this. Um, it is the prettiest champagne color. I usually just pair this with eyeliner, um, or if I'm feeling risque, um, with my mascara, which are the two products I'll show you in a bit. And that I got on sale for like $5.99, I want to say $6.99, around there. Um, they're usually around like maybe $8, $8 or $9, at least it's at the drugstores that I go to. So, so the eyeliner uh, I was talking about earlier is the Wet n Wild Mega Liner Liquid Eyeliner. Liner, 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 liner. It has a bit of sparkles in it, but you can't even notice. Honestly, it's just... You don't even notice it. It's just black, and I wear this usually every day. And the last thing I use for... Um, oh, I forgot to mention. The Wet n Wild eyeliner was about $3, $2.99, $3.99... I don't know. Their Wet n Wild products are really inexpensive. And yeah. So the last thing I like to use is the Maybelline Rocket Mascara. And this, I have like a like, dislike, love, hate relationship with this. The one looks like that. I like the formulation. It stays a long time. It doesn't smudge on my eyelashes. Smudge? What? It doesn't clump, is what I mean. This, and this I also got on sale for like around five dollars. Um, I think it might have been like five fifty or like around there. So I just added everything up and the grand total of all of my products that I use on a daily basis, give or take, is around $132.05. Um, <laughs> I mean, I've seen people go up to $300 using all high-end products, but I mean, that, it's not, it's not bad. <laughs> So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I'm sorry for the lack of videos lately. Um, I've been so busy, you know, end of the year, tests and projects and essays and exam preparation and graduation and uh, so much planning. But yeah, I'll be posting a lot more frequently in a little bit, and my birthday is really soon, so tell me down below if you want a birthday haul or a prom like outfit of the day or like getting ready video or like I don't know whatever you guys want post it in the comments. Stay tuned for the next video and let me know how much your face costs.